G'day YouTube, uh, with Linux Mint 19 currently in the beta version, I just thought I'd show you guys something uh, very central to the Linux Mint ecosystem, which is the, the software manager. So uh, let's have a look and see what that actually looks like. All you need to do is go to the application menu and hit software manager and pretty much see it here. So it is still fairly bare bones, which isn't something I'm overly impressed about. Uh, it is a place that a lot of Linux Mint users do go to in order to install some software there. But let's see how it goes. So we've got Google Earth here straight off the bat. They're sort of advertising that one a little bit. Uh, let's see if we were to task in for uh, additional packages and things of that nature. Go to install, that's good. We'll see how that goes at the end of the video, of which it will be a short video anyway. But uh, basically we've got the editor's picks, of which that was one there, and the categories. If we want to get some Office applications, we could go across here. LibreOffice uh, Libre Office is already uh, installed by default, uh, version 6, which is great to see. So no need to install that one there, but we can go down the list and get some more lightweight Office programs, for example. Uh, oh, I already know we've got Vim GDK. That would be an interesting one to download for a bit of fun later. Uh, but uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, probably something that's always a little bit of fun is games if we've got that too so we'll have a look and see what they're working with here and a few bits of fun neverball was always uh, neverball always fun as well so might install that one as well but this is pretty much it guys uh, a little bit bare bones um, it's very very similar in nature to the ubuntu software center so um, uh, the Ubuntu one's actually a little bit nicer to be honest, but it's got all the same stuff for the most part there. And that's uh, pretty much, uh, I guess, uh, yeah, just uh, probably thousands and thousands of apps of free, most of most of which free, open source, that kind of thing. But this is pretty much it, guys. This is uh, your, your, your middle point uh, for anything, your central internal point for anything Linux Mint 19, really. Uh, so that's it, guys. Uh, hope you've enjoyed. Cheers. Thanks for watching.